everyone, my name is Dr. Sarais, and I am a dentist at Smile Dental Center. So to start this little talk, I wanted to say how I got here. So it all started with college, where I did four years of my bachelor's degree in any type of science. You just need to have the prerequisites for dental school. And then dental school is another four years. And then after that, you could do a residency if you like to, just to specialize or just to have a little bit more practice. Um, there's not a lot of free time once you're in dental school because it's basically just dental school, like from 8 a.m. to sometimes 10 at night. Not because you're working that whole time, but especially the first two years, you're learning to do different things like shaping teeth and etc. etc. which is actually very fun. Um, and then after that, I did a two-year residency at The Ohio State University. So that was how I got all the way through. That was what, like 10 years? Give or take. So what got me into dentistry? So my best friend's father, who is a dentist, had this book in, in their living room about a condition called cleft palate. A cleft palate is a condition, for those of you that don't know, where the lips don't form properly and the lips basically a little bit open. Um, but in some cases, it's not only the lips, it's also the palate or even like the teeth in that side won't form properly. So, you know, the well-being of these children is completely masked just because sometimes they can't even eat. So there's this um, mission called Operation Smiles where dentists and oral surgeons from the country go to other places in the world and fix this for free. So initially I wanted to do that because I thought it would be awesome to help people. Now, my favorite thing about being a dentist is being able to change people's lives. You know, everything that we do is amazing just because it's a very dynamic job. You don't only like talk and meet patients, you also are able to fix teeth that are broken or do extractions that are teeth that are infected or have been causing them pain. But you also are able to, to touch their lives in a different way. I've had many patients that have come to me and have trusted me to change their smile because maybe when they were 10, they were on a bike and hit their two front teeth and they've always been broken or chipped or discolored. And they said, well, now it's time. And now I'm changing their smile for them and helping them feel more confident in themselves. So I think that's the best part of the job. My day-to-day, -day, well, I am very lucky working at Smile Dental Center. Um, so I have a kind of, um, how do you say that? A, a mixed schedule. So some days I work in the morning, some days I work in the evening which gives me a lot of free time in the mornings to spend with my children or in the afternoon just to enjoy the weather, especially now in the summer. That's gonna be very nice. But on the days that I start, let's say in the morning, I start at eight and I usually see from one to two patients per hour. And I also do the hygiene charts. So I'm not only working with my patients, but I'm also working with the patients that have come in for a hygiene, which, you know, kids are very dynamic. It's nice to be able to talk to people and see how they're doing and they ask you, you ask them about their lives because now you have a relationship with them. Um, sometimes I get to do fillings, other times I get to do crowns, bridges. If I'm lucky, I'll have an aesthetic case, I'll be able to fix someone's smile. And every now and then I also get an extraction, which is actually very cool. For any of you that think of applying into dental school or becoming a dentist, I would encourage you to do so. Um, yes, it is a challenge, not only because you're sacrificing basically, you know, your young age, studying, like working, like basically till 10 at night sometimes, over the summers you have to study for your boards. And then once you're in your residency, you'll have to take call at the hospital and things like that. But 2020, it's pretty amazing because you're still young when you're done and you get to feel good about yourself every day only because you're